BTN broadcaster Matt Millen has ties to the state of Michigan. Millen's eight-year run as the top executive of the Detroit Lions didn't go amazing in the way that his playing career and broadcasting career have gone. It's funny watching Detroit fans want to hate him, then meet him and get disappointed once they see how friendly and likable he is. For those who haven't got to meet him yet, well, they resort to Twitter. After all these years, Millen still hasn't perfected his John Madden impersonation. Yeah, yeah, so, so Matt, yeah, John here. So, uh, so, so if you look at this guy right here and you see he's going over there, so I think I actually do that pretty good, better than you could do. Other than playing football, I have yet to find a profession that Matt Millen does well. That's just, just you don't know me very well. <laughs> the heck? Uh, this is the first time I've ever met you there, Mr. T-Bone. So uh, I'm thinking right now that uh, other than writing tweets, I have yet to find anything that you could do well. So it makes us even. <laughs> Matt Millen is terrible on TV, just terrible. He might be worse on TV, then he was running the line. Now that's going too far. That's just, that's just too far. He's that bad. You know what? My kids would agree with you. That's why they turn a channel whenever they're watching. <laughs> Things that I would rather listen to instead of listening to Millen comment. Nails on a chalkboard. I would agree with that. I don't like them either. Friday by Rebecca Black. What's that? I never heard of that. So anything else. <laughs> that's a, at least this guy knows what he wants. I like that. That's good. Millen seems like a likable guy, but I have no idea what he's talking about half the time. You sound like my wife. <laughs> oh, is this my wife? What the heck? 